Ladies and gentlemen, this is Joe's Classic Video Games back with another classic arcade game. Look what rolled into the arcade. Sega's Virtua Cop 2. Guardian of Virtua City. We've been working on this one a little bit. Finally got it ready to go. We figured we'd film a video for all of our YouTube fans so they can remember what 1995 looked like. Thing's still in pretty decent shape. This was Sega's little square cabinet on wheels that they were using for a while there. So Virtua Cop was in this cabinet, Virtua Cop 2 was in this cabinet. Um, House of the Dead could come in this cabinet. House of the Dead 2. Uh, Jurassic Park The Lost World was in this cabinet the good shooting game cabinet and then there was a really similar cabinet that uh, Star Wars Trilogy came in that's a really cool game it has a little uh, control panel on the front though it's, it's probably actually a different cabinet but it looks really similar very fun it's a really good looking cabinet you can see there's some bolt holes here that somebody put bolts in that's where they would have had a uh, like a big metal bar that went across the front so that you couldn't break into it and steal all the quarters. Leave the quarters alone. It's got a little silkscreen glass marquee like the old school games had. By this time most of the marquees were little pieces of uh, plastic but not Sega. Oh, wait a minute. Am I right? Is that glass? Yeah, it's glass. You can see where it's, you can see where it's delaminating a little bit. Virtua Cop 2. Very cool. So this is the sequel to... What was the name of the game? The, the one that this is the sequel to? Virtua Cop 2 is the sequel to... Hmm. I don't know. I'm going to have to act like I don't know and then see how many people tell me in the comment section below. All right, Officer 1 is on the left. There's a little speaker behind that grill, of course. And Officer 2 is over there, and there's a little speaker behind that grill, of course. And some of the sounds for Officer 1 come out over here, and some of the sounds for Officer 2 come out over there. And blinking little start buttons. I have yet to figure out what in the world that is for. There must be, there must be something behind it or something. All right, Sega AM2. AM R&D department number two. Isn't that the one that made um, Daytona? Virtual Cop 2. Items. During game, when you shoot background items, a bonus item may appear. So automatic. Various items other than the above are hidden in the stages, so try shooting to discover them. Discover them. Automatic and a rifle and a machine gun and life and only the shadow knows. How to reload. Virtua Cop guns hold six bullets. They look like they would hold more, but they hold six. When the gun runs out of ammo, point outside the screen and pull the trigger to reload it. Pretty standard stuff, people. Lock on sight. This part's important. The lock on sight automatically detects the enemy and allows you by watching the arrow indicators to know the moment the enemy will fire you lose one life point when the timing targets target sights synchronize so by the time when it, so it starts out yellow whenever it turns red they spin around whenever they hit together uh, the guy shoots you protect hostages during play if you shoot the hostage by mistake you lose one life point don't shoot me Here, a license seal or an original seal here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Look what they did. They put it inside the glass. Likely, so little punk kids wouldn't steal it. Let me tell you though, it's useless anyway. You don't need that. Game over. When you lose all of the allotted life points, the game is over. So, in other words, just your, just your standard. 
shooting game rules. You can see how it gives you this uh, shooting gallery effect where it looks like the monitor is way back in there. But really the monitor is of course in the bottom pointing up at a big mirror inside the cabinet. Very cool. Really good looking game. We did another video where we took the gun apart and put a new case on it. So look for that on our channel. But you know what we're going to do right now? I'm going to go get the tripod. We're going to set it up. I'm going to crank up the music. So I'm warning you right now. I'm going to crank up the music. And uh, we're going to play through it a little bit and see how far we can get. game has a nice flat top on it to set a drink, a beverage on. Alright, now I cranked the sound way up. And I haven't even heard how, how loud it is, so watch your ears. It might be crazy. If it is, I'll turn it down just a little bit, but I want it to be loud, right? So here we go. Oh, phew. that's not loud. That's loud. Chase. That's me. That's me, people. That's what I look like. So the little yellow things on the side, if they get together, they turn red, and that means that you just got shot. Sacrifice my accuracy, people. Give me that damn. <laughs> what, what, was, what was he still? A laptop? Mm. Man, it must be set on like quarter munching mode. complete people don't shoot who this look at that guy just showing his ass hey, hanging out the window while he's driving down the street and he's driving Shot a good guy. <laughs> Whoops, headshot. What? what? What happened there?
her gun goes flying sometimes. Hostage was still there. Shoot the signboard and choose your way. I think we go downtown, people. what they meant by automatic. This doesn't even have this many assholes. There's like 800 people so far in whatever organization this is. It must be the CIA or something. <laughs> guy's about to get dealt with. He keeps running in the in the front of everything. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Where are you looking? I'm over here. 
enough of that. It's a little walk down memory lane, Virtual Cop 2. Now, by the time you see this video, Virtual Cop 2 may have gotten called off to someone else's house. We may not even have it available for sale anymore. You can see what we do have available for sale on our website. Go to lionsarcade.com. Now, if you're local, you can come by and see us. We're in downtown Rock Hill, South Carolina. And we've got a building full of arcade games like this that we're always working on. This is just one of the, my, our latest ones. Rookie cop. I'm a rookie cop. Now, if you... Uh, I shot two civilians. That wasn't good. We'll let it in. I don't want I don't want people knowing that I did that badly, you know, because I wasn't really trying, you know. If I was really trying, I'd put my name in and be proud of it, but I wasn't really trying. So if you can't come by and see us, and you don't want to buy a game by checking out our website, that's fine. Just subscribe to us here on YouTube, and it'll send you a note every time that we upload a new video, which, let me tell you, spoiler alert, is often. Now... Everybody played this game back in the day, so leave your comments below about where you played it, when you played it, and make sure to give us a thumbs up. Well, <laughs> a thumbs up for taking the trouble to film it for you. We didn't have to do that. Aren't we nice? So we stayed late this evening and filmed it for you. Give us a thumbs up to help share it around YouTube so everybody sees it. We're trying to film all these so that people can remember what these games are like because who knows how much longer they'll be around, especially with these big, huge CRTs in them that they do not make anymore, especially for gun games too, you know. So uh, leave your comments below, give us a thumbs up, and we will see you on the next video. Virtua Cop 2.